Hi, my name is Dave, and today I'm going to show you how to make sticky grilled chicken with asparagus. It's the perfect blend of sweet, salty, tangy, just a beautiful sauce. Let's get it started. All right, so that's all mixed up. It smells outstanding. What we're going to do is we're going to save a quarter cup of this for later. Set that aside. We're going to throw the chicken in now, and we're going to have this marinade for a few hours. I would suggest doing it overnight, so give yourself the time to do this the day before. We're going to mix this all in, and then let this sit for three hours right now before we cook. It smells outstanding. It's going to be so good. Okay, the grill's all fired up. Perfect temperature. We've got it on the riser, so it's about medium-high heat right here. We're going to put on the sticky chicken, and then with our extra marinade we saved, we'll baste that along the way. We'll probably flip every three to four minutes, have it on for about a total of 20 minutes. First thing I'm going to do, which will kick up a little flames here, but uh, I'm just going to rub a little oil on here so the chicken doesn't stick. Then we're going to throw on our sticky chicken that's been marinating. Ours has been marinating about three hours. Again, do this overnight if you have the time. Oh, that sizzle. This marinade smells so good. Outstanding smell. So we're going to let this cook, flip every, say, three to four minutes. When we've got about six, seven minutes left, we'll probably throw on the asparagus, and then we'll be ready to eat. Okay, this is just our first flip. We won't throw the asparagus on yet, but probably during the second flip, we'll look at getting a spot, put on some little oil, and throw the asparagus on so it's ready to go as well. Okay, the chicken's come along beautifully. We're going to use some of the marinade that we set aside. Give this a little baste. Now we're gonna flip these. Don't use your bare hands. We're gonna give another baste to this side. It smells outstanding. Now, just so it's ready at the same time, we're going to take our asparagus. Lay down a little olive oil. Coat them in a little olive oil as well. Spread these out along the plancha. Sprinkle on a little bit of kosher salt and a little bit of coarse pepper here. This is all smelling really good. We'll probably flip this a couple more times. This will probably take anywhere from five to seven minutes for the asparagus. And then we'll be ready to plate these and eat. The smells coming from this grill are outstanding. The chicken looks and smells amazing. The perfect char on the asparagus. We're gonna plate these up right here, and the chicken's ready to go here too. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, don't wanna burn myself, but I gotta try the asparagus first. Mm. Grilled asparagus is incredible. I mean, again, very little needs to be done to make this just a great side. So good. This chicken. So juicy. Look at that. So good. The flavor of that marinade. Just an incredible, fun, easy to do dish. You got to give this a try. This is so good. I was so excited to take a bite. I forgot to give it a little topping here of sesame seeds on the chicken for a nice little topping garnish. Again, I'm Dave. Thanks for watching Bus and Eats. 
Join us again for some more great grilling. Have a great day. Spread love through barbecue.